Kayla Lukenbach is a junior now, and I kind of, as I first started breaking down her film, like thought, I don't know how, like she was averaging 20, 21 a night at that point. And I mean, shooting probably about 70% from the floor. And I'm going, we, we, but the more I watched, I went, well, she's cheap. She goes left. I started picking up. She really likes to go left. She's a righty, but she goes left. So we we basically played on her to go right, and we and we dug in on the post. I mean, to the point of we basically we didn't say we're trapping it, but we were essentially trapping it. I just want my kids to get the habit of you know be able to still find a shooter and that. And so to her credit, she only had six points against us, which was. I mean, we felt like we did great with them. They had a shooting guard. They had a shooting guard go off for 29. So it's like pick your, you know, pick your poison, right? But she. Yeah. yeah. I think that's something. Sure. Because there's not great pain. He knows how to attack. And then. And when you're doing something right now, all the truth is you just don't do. I know. I know. It's incredible. <laughs> Right. Oh, it gives you absolutely. Well, and the other part that's been really great is with with crossover with huddle. Everyone's got other stuff on the phone, so I've got enough connections now where. We exchange stuff, and I, I kind of hope that we could just that could be like football. Like you get to exchange film because I've always I've always argued too, you can exchange it, but what someone does with it is completely different. Like how do you incorporate? How do you use it? Do you actually watch it? Um, well, yeah, I mean it's, it's, it's one thing it's one thing to watch a film; it's another to watch and study it, and right? Sure. Pick up sure. And, sure. And I was lucky, so years ago when I was working with Galbensky and Dan Nemechek and oh, yeah. those guys, and Dan is, is just, I mean, the guy's got a mind for the game. Like, it's one of those things where he's seen, them, he's, he can tell you a play he saw, like, in 1975, who was where. But they, he, he taught me a lot about how to scout, how to, like, you know, what, what are you looking for? What are you going to try to do? And then... Then it becomes knowing your team, and get, but there's been game plans like in the, in the past. I've looked at our scout, and I'm like, God, I just I gave our team way too much, and and you know what what is it that we wanted? And I have always thought, man, the the guy that uh, you you hear about is Belichick is how his ability he he has the ability to take away a team's strength better than anyone. Like that's always his philosophy. We're gonna try to take away your strength as opposed to like exploit a weakness. He's like, no, we're gonna stop the strength. Yeah. And um, yeah, like we're exactly. we're gonna try to take away. And I've I've always been big on like if the kids got a superstar, let's try to make someone else. Mm -hmm. For sure. You know, put kids in like, their non comfort zones. It's hard to do at this level. Somebody else steps forward. Yep.